one of the thousands driving over the grapevine to get to Southern California this weekend. Dirk Verdorn joins us now with a red flag alert. Dirk, what's this mean? Yeah, it means we have uh, the winds. We have those northeast winds that are going to be picking up over Southern California, and that's going to increase the fire danger. That's something you don't want to be talking about here at the end of November. But yeah, Southern California, it's been dry enough, and the winds are going to be strong enough to where that could be a problem. So here's a look at your red flag warning. We're looking at this lasting through this afternoon through Friday afternoon. Northeast winds 25 to 35 miles per hour with gusts 45 to 55 miles per hour possible and humidity is driving down. Look at that anywhere from single digits here 2 to 8 percent humidity is possible as we go through again from today through Friday with those strong winds. So this is the way things are going to play out. We're looking at again those wind gusts especially near the canyons. You've got those communities that are near the canyons. That's where you're going to have some of the stronger winds. We're looking at wind gusts here anywhere from 20 to between 20 to 40 miles per hour. Uh, 38 in Needles, 36 in Santa Clarita, and so you can see those stronger winds in those areas. It just kind of it, it just funnels the winds. You can see that strong from the northeast going from the mountains through the valley and then out into the Pacific, and that's going to be taking place, like I said, through Thursday. Friday starts to taper off, but we're still going to have some strong winds in select locations like San Bernardino and Santa Clarita. That's the latest with the wind situation in Southern California.